and children welcome once again to our english lesson this lesson focuses on unit 13 of your grade 10 textbook we are going to study grammar this lesson is the second in a series of three lessons in which we are going to learn conditionals today let's learn how to use type 2 of the conditional sentences correctly let's start the lesson Children, we have already learnt about conditional sentences in our previous lesson. I hope you have watched it and if you have not done so, subscribe to our channel and watch it first. In that lesson, we learned the type 1 of the conditional sentences. Today we are learning the second type of the conditional sentences. Children, as already learnt, a conditional sentence is a sentence structure commonly used in English to talk about something that may happen only if something else happens first. In other words, in conditional sentences, we discuss the result that may occur based on a particular condition. Have a look at this example. It is a type 2 conditional sentence. If I won a lottery, I would buy a car. We call this a conditional sentence because there is a condition in it. The condition laid here is explained by the clause if I won a lottery. So if this condition is fulfilled, the speaker would buy a car. So I would buy a car is the result clause. It shows the result of fulfilling this condition. But children, fulfilling this condition may be theoretically possible, but practically very unlikely as it is an imaginary situation. So look at the example once again. If I won a lottery, I would buy a car. It describes an imaginary situation. In other words, it talks about a thing which is very unlikely to happen in the future. So type 2 of the conditional sentences talk about imaginary situations. Children, now let's see how a type 2 conditional sentence is written. As you can see, the verb of the conditional clause 1 is in simple past tense. The verb in the result clause would by is written with would plus the verb infinitive. Here the infinitive means the base form of the verb. Here are some more examples for the type 2 conditional sentences. They are all imaginary situations. Let's read them. If I had wings, I would fly in the sky. If he were the president, he would increase the salaries. If you were my sister, we would live in the same house. Children, with imaginary situations, you usually use were even with third person singular subjects. If she were, if he were, and if Abdul were. Okay, children. I hope now you can understand the type 2 conditional sentences. Now let's do an activity to practice what you have learnt. This is activity 5 on page 134 of the textbook. There are 5 sentences with blanks. You have to fill the blanks with the correct form of the verb given within brackets. Pause the video and do it. Okay, let's see whether you could do it correctly. Look at the first sentence. If I had a million rupees, I blank use it to help poor people. So here the blank is in the result clause. In type 2 of the conditional sentences, the verb form of the result clause is would plus the infinitive form of the verb. 
okay so how do you write the answer you will have to write if i had a million rupees i would use it to help poor people now look at the second one if i blank write an interesting novel i would become famous throughout the world so here the blank is in the condition clause so what how do you write the verb here in type 2 of the conditional sentences in the condition clause you have to write the verb in past tense simple past tense so what is the answer if i wrote an interesting novel i would become famous throughout the world now the third sentence if savindu were the captain of the sri lankan cricket team everyone blank know him So if Savindu were the captain of the Sri Lankan cricket team everyone would know him Now the fourth one if he blank be the manager of a company he could increase our salaries So here again you have the blank in the condition clause So how do you write your answer If he were the manager of our company he could increase our salaries now the last one they blank live in the town if they had money to buy a house there so here you have the blank in the result clause so you will have to answer it like this they would live in the town if they had money to buy a house there okay children I hope you could get all correct. Okay children, let's do one more activity. Here you have to underline the correct answer from the three options given. Pause the video and do the activity now. Okay, let's check your answers. Okay, what about the first one? Uh which one did you underline? I will read the sentence with the underlined answers. If Susita won a lottery, he would be a millionaire. Now look at the second one. If I were rich, I would quit my job. Third one. I would travel around the world if I had a large amount of money. Fourth one. I would buy the most expensive car if you wanted. Fifth one, I would help the poor if I were a millionaire. Last one, I would give some money to charities if I were rich. I hope you could underline all the answers correctly. Children, that marks the end of our lesson. In this lesson we practice grammar. We learned how to use type 2 of the conditional sentences correctly. In our next lesson we will learn how to use type 3 of the conditional sentences. So please subscribe to our channel. Goodbye.